up is versus da 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 because if you really feel the downbeat you can really feel the evenness of the upbeat right and how it's that opposite pole of the downbeat right versus that's so different right pole it has this kind of forward pulling motion So pay more attention to the feeling of the downbeat when you're going through them, cool. and then the contrast when you're playing on another part. Um, should, I, should I do? Should I do? You can do your strum. You can mute it. Mute it. Strum. So you got to two. So you got to two. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. So. You change where the downbeat was. So it'd be. Uh, so it's. Uh, uh, it's one. Uh, two, three, four. Uh, two, three, four. Uh, two. You, so basically, the downbeat is still accented feeling wise. Right, right, right. Even though strumming wise, two is accented. So it's going to. Uh, uh. See, I'm playing two oh, loud, yeah, yeah, but yeah, I'm yeah, feeling yeah. more feeling right. one. So like. Uh, two, three, four. Uh, two, three, four. Just as much as anything. There's a rest, it's still the strongest. So the accent is not on one, one's still the strongest. Right, right. 